If you support our troops, you need to hear this. If you walk through any parking lot in America, you're bound to come across this decal, expressing a sentiment that all Americans share. But is support for our troops by our government as strong as it can be? Unfortunately, there is great room for improvement. First, combating the enemy's weapon of choice, the RPG, or rocket-propelled grenade. These compact shoulder-fired weapons have been a menace to tanks and armored personnel carriers. Well, so far, RPGs have killed 40 U.S. troops in Afghanistan and 130 in Iraq. But there's some hope. It's called Trophy, an automatic anti-RPG system developed by the Israelis. It's mounted on a tank or personnel carrier, and when an RPG enters a tank zone of protection, it is tracked by radar and intercepted by a small guided missile. Now, tests have shown the trophy system to be 99% accurate. It has been tested. It is proven, ready to be deployed. So will our troops get the trophy? No, they won't. Why? Because the Army awarded a $70 million contract to one of their favorite contractors, Raytheon, to build a similar system from scratch. The Raytheon system has never been tested. In fact, it's still on the drawing board, won't be ready until 2011. Not only that, the Government Accounting Office is looking into possible violations into how that contract was awarded. Now, in the meantime, our soldiers have virtually no defense against RPGs. But hey, at least uh, Raytheon gets their contract.